I'm Will Rivera, and I'm the owner and manager of uh, Running Souls, downtown Elizabethtown, Kentucky. Born and raised in Puerto Rico, and joined the Army at a young age, and uh, pretty much just spent my time in the military, 25 years. After the military, which happened to be nine years ago, we uh, decided to retire and settle here in Elizabethtown, Kentucky, and decided to open the shop. And it's been running strong now for nine years. People ask me all the time, how can you go from Army to selling shoes? Well, I hate to say it, but I was selling the Army and I was good at it. I like helping people. In the military, what's all about kind of like training and developing soldiers. I take that same approach to our community, you know, uh, helping people just get up their feet, keep moving. When you're passionate about something, it translates into what you do for a living. And now that I always love running, it's, it was the same situation, so it came hand in hand. Training and experiencing things that I've done have been kind of like in the same concept, but you know, just finding things that I know are challenging, but are also gonna be fun. The most meaningful uh, event that I have participated was like the Boston Marathon. It's the oldest, right? It's the original Boston Marathon. It's still running the same course. Uh, I think I cried or I had some kind of tear, you know, saying every mile of the way running into the finish line. It meant a lot to me. There's other races, but nothing like Boston Marathon. Each one of them holds a different unique story to them. Some of them, you know, if you've been to Boston, weather changes like in a second. This was a perfect year, that was a hot year, and the other one was like a cold, breezy, freezing rain uh, year. So uh, even though it's the same race, they all felt different, you know, my experiences, you know, towards all four of them. After I ran Boston four times on the road, I was like, okay, there's gotta be something else other than marathons. So I, I started learning about ultras. In the race format, I did a 153 mile race in Greece. You have to take care of your body. If not, you won't be able to run 153 miles. Now, ultras, what I liked about them is that you are exposed to being in the woods. Most of the races, you're in trails. And being in the military, that played hand in hand with me because I, you know, I still love being on the, on the wood lines. For me, that's the most enjoyable place to um, you know, be part of uh, when I'm running. Kentucky has lots to offer when it comes to trail running, and that's one of the reasons also that I elected to stay here, because there's a lot of potential places that are very similar to where I'm from when it comes to the mountains, you know, and nature itself. And it's only continuing to grow, especially in this area of Elizabethtown, Kentucky. One of my favorite places is uh, Bernheim Forest, which is it's a nice preserved area that's there and it's got tons of trails. Our group runs and walk meetups are Tuesday and Thursdays uh, every week and uh, everybody's welcome, all paces. And actually we encourage a lot of the beginners to come join us. Flywheel is one of our frequent places that we go after a run. For those that just need some taco, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we call those Taco Tuesday runs. So if you enjoy being outside, definitely come downtown Elizabethtown and experience all the shops and dines and obviously come to Running Souls, but also get outside and bike and hike or run the trails that we have, Freeman Lake and Buffalo. When we first opened, we didn't even realize how much we were needed. It's been awesome to embrace the community, how much they supported us over the years. We always inspire people, kind of like just go for those big dreams and create your own path doing it. And that's what that Blaze Your Own Trail kind of came about. Our mural says it all. You don't have to follow somebody's path. Whatever you think you feel like you want to do, like if it's a dream, train for it and then go for it. Mm -hmm.